Windows Internet Explorer window. Focus on the latest window open. Chicago Associate Pause. Editor Kim Bellware. Hey, Kim. Hi. Thanks for being here. Kim, can you walk us through the timeline of how this all played out? Um, yeah, this has actually been a case that's been in the works for quite a while. It first started um, uh, a little more than eight years ago when this baby was first found on the side of the road in 2004 in December. Uh, this baby was found in an orange Menards bag, and uh, it was really it was found close to Katie Stockton's family's home. And um, she had denied for years that she was the mother. She sort of famously now in this case lifted her shirt and pointed to her stomach and asked prosecutors, does it look like I just had a baby? And uh, for a long time, prosecutors couldn't even get a hold of her DNA to establish that she was, in fact, this baby's mother. Um, there were all sorts of strange turns. Uh, the defense even objected to the name of baby Crystal instead of, you know, baby Jane Doe because Crystal sort of conjured the image of a, a frozen baby, which is obviously not very favorable to, uh, to Katie Stockton. And uh, then it was later found that these two infants, uh, the decomposed bodies of two infants, were in Katie Stockton's trunk, which had been impounded. And uh, it was recently ruled that they couldn't even admit that into the current case. So when she does uh, you know, go forward, she could get up to 60 years since Illinois doesn't have a death penalty. Stock, yeah, exactly. She'll face up to 60 years here in this case.